Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to another video. Today is something quite interesting. Um, quite recently, you may have seen on YouTube if you follow sort of like things like um, Fort Park vloggers, as I call them. Uh, you may have heard that Jungle Escape has actually been removed from uh, the Fort Park website and the app now. Of course, if you did not know about Jungle Escape, Jungle Escape was uh, one of the events the park put on last year for the big, uh, I think it was 40th anniversary celebrations. And um, it was located in the old I'm Celebrity main building. Uh, I'm Celeb lasted 2015 to um, 2018, I do believe. You know, um, yeah, until end of summer 2018, and then it became the infamous and fucking terrible Vulcan Peak, and then it became Jungle Escape last season. Now, what do I think about this? If Jungle Escape is definitely not going to come back this season, it's a brand new bloody world record for um, Thorpe because it will mean that is the shortest lived actor led experience that the park has ever had. Now, as a all year round sort of thing. Because um, Saw Alive lasted two and a half seasons all year round before it became seasonal. I'm a Celeb lasted, I think, two seasons and then became seasonal. So, this one, being added, being removed after a season is, all jokes aside, if Jungle Escape isn't coming back, like people are saying it is, there's a couple of things that is going to happen. Number one, we will probably get a Fright Nights maze in that building at Fright Nights 2020. Now the last time that building was used for a Fright Nights maze was during Fright Nights 2018 when we had Vulcan Peak. I'd like to see a new maze in there. I'd preferably like to see maybe not a jungle themed maze like Vulcan Peak but to, it, I'd love to see a maze like The Welcoming. If you don't know The Welcoming, it was a maze that was at um, Alton Tower Scarefest for a couple of seasons, uh, which was the prequel to Wicker Man, and then it stayed open the year Wicker Man opened at Scarefest. Now, personally, I'd like to see like a Welcoming style maze or prequel maze to the next big thing. Which I think quite a few people were expecting Vulcan Peak to be. I think people were expecting Vulcan Peak to be the prequel to Project 2020. Which we all know isn't happening. So please, stop banging on about it. Alright? It's probably going to be 2022. Something like that. I don't know. Um, so yeah, that's the first thing. Second thing. We might get another actor-led experience there in the 2020 season. That's something which I think could, could go either way. We could get an actor led experience this year in there or we might not now recently i am um, i know someone put in a construction update that the actual side of the i'm a celebrity building uh, one side of it had been painted silver now personally i think we might get a new experience there this year or another thing that might happen is it might just stand sbno Oh yeah, it might just not have anything to do with it, or worst case scenario, they might just knock that building down. Now you've got to think, you've got the um, Nemesis Inferno shop in there, so I don't think they're going to knock down the building while Inferno is still running, and obviously Inferno is having a bit of work done to it this season. Um, but yeah, personally, do I think Jungle Escape? It's going to come back this year. I don't think it will. Or if it does, it's going to have some major changes. I know it got mixed reviews last year. Uh, 
most of the reviews were saying because it was paid extra, a pay extra experience, people didn't want to do it. Obviously Merlin also opened the Alton Towers dungeon last year, which is pay extra as well. And at times the deals were better for the dungeon than it was for Jungle Escape. So yeah, comment below what you think is going to happen. Personally, in all honesty, I want to see a really good maze in there this year. But as many people will probably agree with me, I, although I never got to do the Asylum maze, I think it'd be good to have a strong maze in that building because they've done it before. That that, may, that building can be used for some good mazes. Vulcan Peak not included. Anyway, uh, that's the end of this video. Please comment below your thoughts on do you think Jungle Escape is going to return for 2020 or are we going to see a new maze? And if, and if we are going to see a new maze in that building for Fright Nights 2020, what do you want to see? Do you want to see an IP or do you want to see a, an original concept like how Creek Freak Massacre was? Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.